हेलो नेटवर्किंग एंथोजियस्ट वेलकम टू द चैनल गोन टुडे आई विल शो यू हाउ टू कॉन्फिगर स्टैटिक राउटिंग इन सोनिक एक्चुअली स्टैटिक राउटिंग इज वेरी ओल्ड कॉन्सेप्ट इट इज नॉट करेंटली इन यूज इट हैज बीन रिप्लेस बाय रिप आईएसआईएस ईआईजीआरपी एंड सो ऑन नाउ एज वी नो इन सोनिक ऑल द पोर्ट्स आर इन लेयर 3 All ports have assigned default IP addresses. So, before starting of the video, I have removed all those default IP addresses and assigned those IP addresses that we have to use in our topology. <coughs> Now, I will go into R one. Here, here, I will show you the status of IP interfaces by using command show IP interface. as we can see here ethernet 0 and 4 have assigned those ip addresses that we have to use in our topology now now as we can see in the topology this router knows this route and this route it does not know anything about this route so to static route i have to manually add this route In the routing table of this router. Now, I will use command sudo config route add prefix and let me check the command sudo config route add prefix. Yes, sudo config route add Prefix and prefix is one nine two dot one six eight dot twelve dot zero. Prefix one nine two dot one six eight dot twelve dot zero slash twenty four. Next hop. And our next hop is this ten dot. Then next hop one nine two dot one six eight dot ten dot. So now. I will save the configuration by using command sudo config save one. <coughs> Now I will go into R two. I will go into R two and add this route in the routing table of R two, and the next hop address would be ten dot one. R two. sudo config route add prefix one nine two dot one six eight dot and eleven dot dot eleven dot zero slash twenty four next hop one nine two dot one six eight dot ten dot one and the next hop is ten dot one dot ten dot Now I will save configuration using command sudo config save y. Now again I will go into R one and now I will see the routing table using command show IP route. As we can see here, there is a one route. S S stands for as we can see here. Uh, where is S S S stand for static route. This route is present in the routing table of R one through static routing protocol. Now I will go into R two, and now here I will also run the same command. Show IP route. Here, here we can see route eleven dot zero is a static. Now again I will go into R one. Now, I will assign IP addresses to this host. Let me go into this host. First of all, I will check the status of IP by using command show IP. Here, no IP address is assigned. Now, I will assign IP address using command IP one nine two dot one six eight dot eleven dot two slash twenty four, and the gateway is one nine two dot one six eight dot eleven dot. 
now i will go into ec2 here i will also sign ip address 192.168.12.2 slash 24 192.168.12.1 is our gate now uh, pc1 this uh, yes now i will generate a ping request from host 1 to host 2 ping 192.168.12.2 <laughs> as we can see here pc1 is getting reply from pc2 and the main interesting thing that we must note is that TTL is decremented by 2. By default, it is, it is 64 and now it is 62. What does it mean? In the path of this route, there are two hopes R1 and R2. That's why TTL is decremented by 2. Now, I will also generate a ping request from PC2 to PC1. ping 192.168.11.2 yes everything is fine now i will generate a ping request for r ping 192.168.10.1 now everything is fine here we can see ttl is decremented by one because in this path this path there is only one route so ttl is decremented by one. so thank you guys for watching my video if you want more videos like this kindly subscribe my channel